Hi everyone, I'm Serena. And I'm Millie, and this is Kuka. And this is Pink Eraser Art for Kids. What is Pink Eraser Art? It is where you can use a normal, boring pink eraser. You can use any brand. You don't have to use um, Pink Pearl. Just use it. That's anything. right. Any brand eraser. It could be laying in your house. It mm -hmm. could be at the bottom of your backpack, yeah. left over from school, whatever. And you can carve <laughs> it into a stamp. When you're going to start carving, what's the most important thing? That you don't cut yourself. That's right. Safety first. That's why if you're going to do pink eraser art, you need to have a parent supervision, right? Mm -hmm. With our little carvers, we're using sharp, sharp blades. And yes. so we're going to show you some yes. safety tips for how you hold the eraser. And most important, make sure you have an adult and you ask permission to be able to use a carver. So today we're going to teach you guys how to carve a chocolate bar stamp out of a boring little eraser. Should we get started? The first thing you're going to need is your carver. You're going to need an eraser. You're going to need a pencil and an ink pad. And a piece of paper. And a piece of paper. <laughs> <laughs> it's important when you're gonna do carving that you have an adult's help because this is a sharp blade. And so you have to have a parent when you're gonna be doing eraser carving. Ready to start sketching? We're gonna sketch right onto our eraser. Oh. We're not even gonna worry about it. We're not even gonna think about it. Okay. You ready? Yeah, maybe. So to yeah. make our chocolate bar, the first thing we're going to do is make a little border around the edge of our eraser. Don't be scared, go all the way to the edge. There you go. See how I have like this much space? Mm -hmm. Next thing, we need our chocolate shapes, right? You know how they're cut up into little squares? We'll mark right here and right here, like a halfway mark. And we'll just do a little line across. And it doesn't have to be perfect. This is just a sketch. It's even okay if it's a little wibbly wobbly. Yeah. Now, that part is the we'll make our little chocolate squares. We just make So we're lines. gonna make little lines like this. Make all those little squares. It looks like we're drawing little abs. <laughs> <laughs> and we're gonna do our wrapper. So we're gonna draw it like a squiggly little line going down. So I'm just gonna draw a very slow squiggle. Yeah, this can be however you wanna do that little squiggle. Good? Then. Wow, it looks very smooth. <laughs> we're gonna start right here where we went down. We're gonna go back up. We're gonna make a really wiggly triangle. They're apart on this side, and they're together on that side. Like this? Oh, no. Yeah, that looks perfect. And that is going to be our chocolate wrapper. Maybe we'll do a little thing right here. What if we draw a little face? With this squiggly, squiggly. What if we draw a little face on it? Oh, it's gonna be a happy chocolate bar. <laughs> I love it. It's Thanks, so man. cute. <laughs> okay, okay, now okay. we're going to draw little squares inside of our little squares. What? <laughs> yep, little squares inside of our little squares. It actually looks better than I expected. Little chocolate blocks. And these don't have to be perfect. Either. They're not. <laughs> not perfect at all. Mine is not perfect, as you can see. <laughs> like a They're rectangle. beautiful! I love them! I did it. Now, do we need to put a big bite out of our chocolate bar? Should we? I think so. You know how to draw a bite mark? Yeah, you kind of just go... Yeah, you go like this. <laughs> like a little whoop, 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 whoop. I just go like this. Those are the teeth. <laughs> so let's go from the corner right here. And let's do a little whoop, whoop. Whoop. A little bite out of our chocolate My bar. My chocolate bar is so tall. <laughs> Alrighty, so I think we're ready tall. to carve. I carve. So let's go ahead and open up your carver. <laughs> Amazing. Which one? You're going to want to start with the size one. 
There's one. And it's the smallest the one. So you have to loosen this up. You slide it in there. And then, then you tighten it. And then you put the thing back on and there's my carver. So the first thing we're gonna do is our little border. So we're gonna start right here at the top of our at the top of our candy wrapper right here. So like right there? Mm-hmm. And I like to hold my carver like this with my finger this way. Now this is really important once you start carving, Millie, that you hold your eraser to the side and you're not like this. Because if you're like this and you slip, you're gonna nick your finger, right? Mm -hmm. So like we wanna this. be safe and we wanna hold it, yep, to the side. So we're not carving towards our hand. So we're gonna put it down right at the top of our little thing. And we're gonna press and we're gonna slide it up that little line. And if you just trust yourself, you can go all the way straight. There you go. Don't yep. stab my Be confident. Fingers. Be confident. Kind of point it down. There you go. And you're gonna carve a straight line. Oh, that, I think that looks pretty good. That looks fantastic. Just, just need to go up a little bit more. Amazing. That looks good. I love it. All right, now let's do the line in the middle. Okay, so like all the way down. Below. Yep, so we're gonna start here. We're gonna press down and we're gonna just push it in a straight line. I'm trying to get, I can't get that piece out. You can use your pencil to push the piece out. You don't wanna use your fingers. There you go. You go on to the next line. You. Yeah. Press down in a straight line I have to, to the end and we're gonna pop it off. Amazing. I love it. Now we're going to turn our eraser to the side and we're going to carve this line across the top. Ready? So like this? Uh-huh. And same thing. We're just going to press down. We're going to stop when we get to the other end. Oh my goodness. This is very hard. There you go. Very good. Now let's make our little crossbars, our little chocolate shapes. Okay. <laughs> so we're going to turn it this way. So we can hold on nice and tight. And we're gonna do the same thing. We're just gonna press down. We're gonna carve all the way um, to the other side. Just I make don't a know line. where. All right, let's do the next one together. Ready? One, two, two three. three. Maybe. I did it! Nice! Hey, you ready for the next line? One, two, three, go. I think I won that one. <laughs> <laughs> now this one. And now the next one. Straight oh. across. Yeah. I did it! Yay! Okay, let's go ahead and carve wow. the Excuse line me. that goes across where we made the top of our wrapper. Okay, that's gonna... So we're gonna cut and we're just gonna go and try to follow that line. Ooh. Just keep pressing and you can wiggle your knife around. Don't cut yourself. Do not cut yourself. Go nice and slow. I'm trying my best to go nice. Awesome. I did good. I kind of messed it up there a little bit, though. It's fine. I love it. All right. You ready to do the next one? Carve. I just kind of make it a straight line. The second line. Yeah, that works. We're going to take out this bottom so we can have that little scriggly, scraggly part of the wrapper. Because we're going to take this little sharp blade and we're going to cut little scriggly, scragglies. Why do you call it scriggly? Because they're scriggly and they're scraggly. Uh, okay. See how I'm doing it? I'm just going right to the end. What? And I'm pressing down and I'm cutting out scriggly oh. scragglies. Oh. This is very scriggly and very scraggly. And That's it's perfect. very pointy. <laughs> now should we do our bite mark? Yes. So to do our bite mark, we're going to switch our blades and we're going to put on a wider blade. We have a pointy one on now. We're going to switch to a smooth one. So we have our U shape. Now let's do- I'm a little bit scared. Ready? We're gonna go in right from the side and we're gonna do a U and oh. then we're gonna do another U. I'm gonna take my eraser. Oh, and that's very, very thick. We're gonna do another U. Oh, I think that looks good. Mine looks really good. That looks so good. Actually, it looks like teeth. The other option is you could just take a bite. No, I'm just <laughs> kidding. Don't eat your erasers. <laughs> and now we're just going to carve out everything Ooh. inside of our U. This My hand here, so I'm still easy. holding on to it, but it's not, it's not even going to touch nice. me. 
Now you want to carve it out all the way to the edge. Like all the way to the edge of the border, all the way to the edge of the eraser. That's the question. Um, to the edge of where your chocolate bar ends. I didn't do my little face. <gasps> you have to do your little, wait, put in your pointy blade. Actually, put in this teeniest, tiniest, teeniest, tiniest blade. I'll show you how to do tiny circles for the eyes, and then you can do it. Okay. Right? <laughs> so if I'm going to do a tiny circle, I'm going to stick this pointy edge of my V-carver down like this. Just press it straight down, and then you're going to do this. Whee! Like that? And then it takes out a little circle. We <laughs> And we have another circle. Oh no! Now, just press very softly. <laughs> and then you have a tiny smile. And then I have to do my cheekies. Let's do our little squares. Okay. So we're just going to do totally forgot about straight those. lines. And we're going to go like this. One. Oh. Two. And then we'll go one. Two. And we're just gonna cut out these little squares. Okay, should we try our ink again? Here's all of our little chunkies. Before. Now let's get our ink. It's okay if you get ink on yourselves. Here we go. Press it all the way down, all around. And I'll just be inking mine. Before. Ready, set, ta da! <laughs> Pressing it down all around. All the little sides and edges. Ready? Ta-da! Look at it! So good! Look at how adorable it is. We made... This is mine. Chocolate bars! Chocolate. Chocolate. <laughs> Here's our erasers! We made chocolate bar. Chocolate bar. Mine is not perfect, but I think I did a great job. You did do a great job. <laughs> and you can give them little faces. You can. You can give them little faces. You can do whatever you want. You can change the design. You can get creative. And you can have all kinds of You can of even fun just make the whole eraser uh, of chocolate. That's so right. You can just. Just like a. I'm just kidding. Don't eat your erasers. <laughs> Don't eat it. Don't eat your erasers. <laughs> Thank you so much for joining us, everybody. I hope that you had fun. If you have any questions, you can comment and ask. And please like and subscribe. Like and subscribe. Bye. Bye-bye.